Today, I spent 200 days in Subnautica, a challenge that would normally be easy. However, I was after the Seamoth only and planned on beating the game with it. I learned early on that shooting torpedoes at Reaper Leviathans would only make them angrier. I scoured the dunes and mountains while looking for different time capsules and even found myself lost while trying to build a base inside the void. I did also make the longest conga line of your names on different Seamoths. If you still wanted a locker, let me know down below. BT Dubs, if you enjoy these types of videos, don't forget to drop a like, hit that subscribe button, and let me know what game you'd want me to play next. Without further ado, I spent 200 days in Subnautica and here's what happened. As months passed on by, this game was cooking. I forgot how big of a base I built, so trying to deconstruct anything was a bit of a problem. Name of the game, to find and gather all the resources necessary for 100 sea moths. Was this a bit overkill? Of course. But did I enjoy every part of it? You better believe your butts I did. What I didn't enjoy was being slapped around in the face by some weird tentacles. Not cool, man. Not cool. What did occur to me later in the day was how I seemed to be running out of resources. Sure, this game had loads all over the place, but the biomes I farmed were pretty much on empty. That was until I found the mother load. Closer to the deep grand reef in all its glory, the sandstone chunks came in waves. One after the next, they were flooding my screen and I wasn't sure what to do about it. All I knew is that I needed to gather everything I could. Even with Karen warning me about my oxygen, the air bladder was still coming in clutch. This far into my game and I use this tool almost on the daily. I could have sworn I heard a Reaper Leviathan, but I'm going to play like I didn't because I don't think I did. Although I might have. As I continued to look for more silver and gold the next day, I worked my butt later into the night, finding myself scared as I heard something from afar. Not okay. We are not okay. We are not okay. We, oh, oh, no, 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 not okay. We are not okay. Uh, uh, please don't break it. Please don't break it. If you break it, if you break it, you got to pay for it. You got to pay for it. Don't pay for it. Don't break it. Don't break it. Yep. I'm going up. I'm going up. Bye 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 bye. Woo! Don't touch my feet. Don't touch my feet. You gonna touch my feet? Great. Now I can't even see. It's really dark. Who knew that sandstone chunks would almost be my downfall? All I could think of now was the Reaper swooping down on me in all of this darkness. There's no more problems. There's no, I I better not see a of a. Of a <laughs> I gotta slow down. I gotta slow down. Okay. So. What have we learned? Don't go too far for sandstone. I don't know why it's showing me sandstone chunk all the way out over here. Oh yeah, we don't have a sea moth. That, yeah, <laughs> that's right. I was just thinking future me for the day. Planning all the sea moths I did, the extra few would come in handy. It felt like most of my other outposts were either out of power or just the resources around. I really did go through most of the stuff in my first playthrough of the game. If you also haven't seen that video, definitely check out the first part of my Subnautica playthrough. What did become the most important goal in my eyes was upgrading the power sources around on the base. I had plenty of bioreactors built and still felt like something was missing. The next few days would be a bunch of prep work, planning out the materials I needed to set up another scanner room and giving my little Jackie boy a slap or two. All right, Jack. I desperately wanted the nuclear power source and the only way to find that was scanning around the world for different parts or crashed wrecks. The first of many being in the Deep Grand Reef, a location deep underwater as it approached the tips of the void, filled with creatures such as a crab squid lurking around and warpers speaking in their own language. I was truly determined this place would give me exactly what I needed. Uh, I probably won't die. Maybe. Uh, you know what? Hold on. I think it's safer if I take my same mod. Ooh, sorry, Karen. Sorry. Ooh, I was about to break you. Oh, not in the fun way. With the new morning here, I was looking to make more space. I needed some extra brain for the scanner room being built. Not only that, but I completely forgot about the upgrades needed for more range. The only problem with that was running out of magnetite, a type of resource found inside the jelly shroom cave and loaded with these giant purple mushrooms, home to a certain crab snake that didn't take kindly to yours truly. That wouldn't stop me as I needed all the magnetite I could find. Hoping to keep my seamoth at a certain depth because I completely forgot I was working off of 200 meters. Oh, sorry, 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 sorry. I don't want to break you. Oh my god. I'm not going to break you. I promise I will not break you. It was only a matter of time before the crab snakes knew what I was up to. Ooh, hello, 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 hello. Sorry. That's all you. I'll get out. Yeah, this is your home. I know my place. It's down here. Ooh, but what if a worm? You think there's a worm in this one? I'm going to double check. Hello? Ooh, where's the worm for this one? I won't go inside. Can I scan this? Oh. Wait, but what if the worm comes in here? Oh. I gotta get out. E 
Okay. <gasps> yes. Scanner room range. So these bad boys hopefully give me what I need. And if they don't, I'm taking them to... Uh, I don't know. This was exactly what the upgrades did for me. Oh, 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 oh my God. It actually goes to some parts of the bottom. That is wonderful thing for everybody when it comes to different types of consoles. Oh, oh, oh my God. Get it off me. Get it off. Get it off. Oh. Oh, I don't know why. I just, oh, man. I'm just expecting a Reaper Leviathan to get me, man. Now I just needed to watch the power so I didn't panic and die. The next part of my plan was building another scanner room, but inside the dunes this time. Yup. I wanted to both know where the Leviathans were and if I could find anything I might have missed. Wait, where am I? I'm right there. Okay, so that one. Is there a third? When, when did they put one up there? Curious to see what the Reaper Leviathans were up to. I had the best idea yet. I don't see you. I see the circle circling the thingy thingy, but I... Oh, there he is. Hey, big guy. Sun's getting real low. Sun's getting real low. Oh, oh, I switched cameras. Oh, crap. Phew, looking at my stuff. I'm not... Wait, you're getting a little close, buddy. You gotta back off. Back the heck off. This is terrifying. This is so terrifying. I hate this so much. Of course, today would be another day. I'd lose another sea moth. I was dared to boop the snoop of a Reaper Leviathan. I'm coming. Face first. Bring it on, punk. Bring it on. Bring it on. Bring it on. Come on. I'm going to ram you first. I'm going to ram you first. I'm so gonna ram you. Oh, I'm gonna ram you in your stupid face. Can you stop going so further out? Oh my god. Please, please. Come here, come here, come here, come here, come here, come here, come here. Don't you turn. Don't you turn. Nope, I'm gonna go down. I'm gonna go down. No, no, no. He's literally not doing anything. Oh, wait, wait. I... Down, 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 down. God damn, I feel like I'm putting in GTA codes for PlayStation 2. Up, down, left, right. No, 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 no. Mm -hmm. No, no, I don't think so. You're not allowed. You're not allowed to touch this. Mm -mm. This is some fine booty. <laughs> I'm like moving in my chair. You're not allowed to come over here. Yep, yeah, booped him in the snoop. Look at that. Totally booped him. We're flying. We're both flying. I can see clear. Now the Reaper got me. The Reaper got me. The Reaper got me. Uh, what do I do? Run, 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 run. Let him have it. I don't care. I got 40 others. I don't care. Okay. Oh, it's still alive. I'm just gonna sneak. I'm just gonna go away. Take a picture of that. Yep. There it goes. Okay. 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 Oh crap. Oh crap. Mama no. Mama no. Mama no. Mama no. Mama no. Don't touch my toes. It worked. I think. I think. I think. Did it work? Did it work? I don't know. I don't know. I'm, I'm no. No, we're not looking down. Seeing that my heart couldn't handle any more scares, that was it. Looking to get some extra power added to my base, solar panels would do just that, stealing all of the power from the sun and into my mighty and majestic place. I was also looking into a water filtration system because, truth be told, my only source of water and food was from the melons growing in my bedroom. This would at least help half the problem for now. I just needed a few more pieces of ruby back inside the blood kelp zone. A location in which that set the ambience to spooky 9000 with these little creepy crawlers ready to jump on your face. Can you teleport for real? Like away? Away. Oh crap. 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 Zigzag. 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 I didn't get scared. You got scared. I didn't get scared. I didn't scare. Oh. Hmm. I'm going, I'm going, I'm going, I'm going. Having all the resources, it was now time to build my very first water filtration system. Reminded by the fact that I didn't actually have the MK1 yet as well for my Seamoth. 
So I would need to pay the Aurora a visit or two again. I even found myself back inside the mushroom forest, a place filled with all the resources a player could want, but finding nothing I needed. It was also a place with many hidden caves with a secret waiting to be found. Picking one of the sea moths for another journey ahead, it was time to see what was up with the Aurora again. I had my propulsion cannon at the ready just in case. My jumping skills were definitely awful, so I needed the extra muscle. I feel like I've been here before, which is gonna be crazy because then where did I put the MK1? That the oh let's try the moon pool. I think that's what I was supposed to do last time. I didn't make a moon pool. I was supposed to do the moon pool last time. I didn't make it. Oh crap. Because you put the thing into the thing and all oh, the oh god it was the one and only thing i truly needed right now i just had to figure out the best place alongside this base this one build this one upgrade console would solve all my problems what if i play factorio will you solve my problems then <laughs> all right this is my sweet pea guys nickname watermelon oh i love the red oh i can't see the red anymore i have to color them all i have to name them something so that should be fun. And then we're going to have them all on the map. As the next day was here, I was confused as to why this kept happening. Each time I jumped back into my base, it was almost like my legs didn't exist, becoming the shortest king to have ever lived. With a new day here, as I picked up my sweet pea, it was time to dedicate some more time to finding nuclear reactor pieces. The mushroom biome was my second pick besides the deep ground reef, and I was just hoping for something really, even just a small sign to point me in the right direction. It was now time to move from one location to the next. Looking to search the grounds of the blood kelp area, I found a few stragglers following me around. JV Jones Jocker, leave me alone, sir. sir. Holy crap. Why are there so many of you? What did I do to you guys? Oh, my first capsule. My first time capsule. Time capsule. Capsule of the time. What do we have? What do we have? What do we got? What do we got? Come on. Oh, I'm full. Free up space to pick up the reinforced diet. Oh, true. What I did end up finding was a not so friendly neighbor. Praise the cheese it lords though, because I did get lucky enough to find more magnetite in the area. I had no idea the blood kelp zone had more advanced resources like this. This next idea of mine had me turning on all different locations I visited once upon a time. I figured I could backtrack a bit and see if there was anything I missed. This first one leading me to the jelly shroom caves again. What is this? Thermal plants? Okay. Anything... Don't you dare eat me. I'll eat you. I'll cut you. What is this? Thermal plant. This looks like... Oh! <gasps> what? Nuke... What? Also, stop trying to eat me. I swear to God. I'll cut you. I'll cut you. You want to fight? Oh, I don't have my knife out. Hold on. Give me a second. Give me a second. All right. I'll, I'll cut you. <laughs> Why was that there? Holy crap. Are you kidding me? All this time, I could have just been going to these locations. <gasps> I killed it. Yes, I did. Look at you. I killed you with my knife. How does it feel? Oh, baby. Oh, my God. Oh, there's another one. Are you kidding me? Get off my dang thing. But father won't let me leave the habitat. Maybe with all this glass, we could build a containment unit and get up close to them. Sad, sad day right there, folks. Don't you worry, though, because I was locked and loaded with another. What's crazy, too, is like I had the upgrades in that, like stuff that gave me armor, hull integrity, and they destroyed it so quickly. Sweet P 2.0. All righty. Now I got to build these goddamn things again. As my new Seamoth and I were prepared to go, it was off to the rendezvous point. All right. So the other two are down here. Oh, this is the crag fields. Oh, I haven't been here in a quick minute. Looking to find anything I may have missed and search for more blueprint pieces. Is there anything inside, though? What do we got inside? Nothing. All right. This would easily help out my Seamoth. I'm going to be honest. Didn't know I could actually create all those things. I am creating every single one of these upgrades and more. Sonar. That's so cool. I finally get the sonar. That's going to help so much at nighttime and just in general. And then depth module one, which is perfect. What really caught my eye was working towards two new depth modules. One sitting at 500 meters and the other at 900 meters. All I needed now was more lithium and any extra diamonds I could find. The perfect place for that was the island sitting atop the water with the precursor facility and laser, housing multiple sources of lithium to diamond outcrops and so much more. Being as close as I was, I could continue crafting two of these depth modules. I did have to revisit the blood cup again. Those white mushrooms were definitely needed for something called polyaline and in doing so would help me craft the strongest module. This would be the day I finally had everything ready for for what was to come. Not only was the sonar my new favorite thing to use, but it gave me so much more confidence while riding through the deep sea water. Oh, here we go. Holy crap. Yes, I got it. I got it. I got it. I got it. Look at this. Woo! <laughs> That's so cool, man.
Yeah, go away. I'm gonna shock ya, zippity zap. <laughs> oh man. My next little visit would be to Life Pod 13, making sure to clear out the checkpoint and then continue my adventure towards the dry lands mark. If that wouldn't cut it, then this next location had to. I had a way to finally go deeper and also see the dangers in front of me. Thinking that I could take on the crab squids in the area, my sea moth was still just a sea moth and not a prawn suit. What I did want was everything inside this old Degasi base. There was a few hidden gems for the taking. This should have been done days ago, but I mean, better now than never, right? All right, look at that, even more. As the next few days went on, I was in search of a lot more metal salvage and mushrooms. The idea was to use my torpedo system the Seamod had and pray it actually did damage to the stuff. I normally just use a knife and a stasis rifle. The toughest part about all this was trying to pick up these beluga looking whales poop. The stuff would explode after a few seconds. Come on, poopy butt. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. Oh, do, 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 won't die. Do I have a, a heal you kit? I do not. Oh, we didn't stay in it too long. Okay, we're good, we're good, we're good, we're good. I was so ready with all the gas pods I had. This literally blew my mind in what I was seeing. Mission accomplished. It was finally time to try out these gas torpedoes on something a little bigger. Oh, you're so lucky. That was gonna hit you. Wait, did I get it? The fudge, where's that one going? It's also that time in the video, and if you made it this far, comment Subnautica 2 down below. Part of me really hoped for something new over the intercoms today. Next communicado. Translated broadcast. Oh crap, they want to kill me. Mode. Patrol. New targets unaccounted for. One. That's me! They want to kill me! Destroy me! Oh my god. <laughs> Oh boy, that's gonna be fun. The next big thing I started doing was organizing all my different sea moths. Also fabricating so many more. I went from like 10 to 15 of them now holding and owning about 30 sea moths. Times were crazy, but I also needed names on these bad boys soon enough. As I was floating around different biomes, jumping from the underwater floating islands to some blood kelp zones, I was searching for one of those crash sites that had it all. Definitely wasn't Life Pod 17, though I did end up moving another scanner room near this kelp area, pushing it further deep below so I could see every part of the biome. The plan here was simple, find more materials and save up enough to build another little scanner room outpost. This one, however, would take me back into the dunes. With my Seamoth upgraded this far out, I figured why not? Yeah, I'm gonna go to this one. This one is huge. Dude, this guy is crazy. Look at this. Oh, he sees me. I got my electric thing going. Yep, okay, cool. So it does affect them. Nice. What I did start feeling was how much closer I was getting to that nuclear power supply. The dunes was but one less place checked off my list. Dude, you're terrifying. Oh my God, that was absolutely scary. Go away, please. Go away, please. Get out of here. Get out of here. You going? I don't know. Let's see. He's gone. I searched high and low, looking for other places I might have missed, soon to become witness of the most beautiful thing I'd accidentally find. What's up, guys? What's going on? Sea Trader Path. Look at this. It's the Sea Trader Path. Let's go. Let's bring it up. Okay, is that the uh, abyss? This would have to do for now. Grabbing the few upgrades from another outpost and seeing what far range scans were in place. We're looking for like a like a vent or something. Hold on. I need to get this thing closer. Welcome aboard, Captain. Oh, there was something there. Oh, hello. What is it? What is it? Moon pool. Yucky. Man, I already found the prawn suit. I don't need that. What is this? What is it? Nuclear! Yes! Nuclear! 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 Oh my god. Oh my god. Nuclear here. Nuclear here. Hello. It's your boy. Nuclear. Oh! <gasps> nuclear reactor! We did it, guys! Oh my god. We actually did it. We actually did it. We actually did it. We actually did it. We friggin' did it, guys. We. F oh my god, yes. Oh my god. That's all I wanted. I'm not even kidding. That's all I wanted. Legit. That is everything I ever wanted. And that is it. The last thing to complete all this craziness was some uranite crystal. These bad boys were located far from the dunes, but not far enough from me. My hands were about to be filled with all the wonders of this place. What did baffle me every time was how long certain things took to find or farm and just grind and gather. After everything I went through for each new build, three reactors paired with my new and improved power source 
Seconds. It took seconds to set it up. Wait for it. 41. Exercise caution. Ooh, look at that. Materials. It's a little laggy because my base is so big. I didn't realize this would happen, but it is happening. And this isn't even modded, man. This is just vanilla. It's because I've been playing on this for too long, apparently. Apparently, that's one thing that does happen to me is when I play a survival game for too long and I build too much stuff, the game can't handle me. I don't know why. I like it, but I don't. Oh, the power is just going to rise now. Look at it. It's just booming. Look at it. Ooh, he's going. All that was left to do, getting ready for the craziest Congo line made up of you guys, the viewers. I just needed to organize a few more things around the place. With all the sea moths fabricated, it was time to spread the rest apart to keep my game from lagging even more. Having so much condensed into one area was never good in any video game. Oh, I got to show you something. This is going to be insane. So I'm going into a new day, obviously, right? coming to the end of this playthrough well not the end but we're getting closer to it with each day passing it's uh <laughs> it's kind of chaotic i'm not gonna lie all right so you may be noticing a lot of sea moths right we have flame kobe and you were asking for like the black base red outline and thank you so much we got zz up i up I, i'm sorry if i didn't pronounce that right but there you go zen four Woo! look at this one it's like a hot cherry <laughs> oh, we got Leo Gibson. And I just want to say thank you. Thank you so much, man. Thank you, Captain Mania with the purple, purple, purple. Thank you, Aaron Cates. Look at this one. And we have Mahan Creeper. Ooh, a little like golden retriever thing going on there. Got another golden retriever here. This is Tubsy. And we have Sean Dell, another Seamoth there. Man, look at you guys. You guys <laughs> I just have a row of all you guys. Next one is Bikes the Darren. This one is like the opposite, but still really cool. We have Nico Mixologist. Next is Danelle Layer. I'm hoping I pronounced your name right there. We have Walker of the Sky. Thank you, Walker. Not a plague doctor. Not a big thank you to your face, man. I have Arctic Case. Next is Thajis Brenderson. Brenson, I think. <laughs> Yeah. First blue so far. Look at that. Nice little blue addition there. And we have a full on green again. Pro chaos. Man. I got you, pro. Don't you worry. I have you. Next is I'm Candy Cane. Hey, Candy Cane. What's up? Next is Bread117. You asked for the purple. You got the purple. Then we have Bents. Nug Nug. I finally got you too. You're the second blue, actually. And yours is like, oh, I, I don't know how to explain it, but I like it. I like the, I like the color seams you got going on. Tyler, all green every day, our day. Gotcha too, buddy. Next is Coleman Pitcher. Hold on. Then we have Gaming on 144 FPS. You said do one or the other, so it was Ace or Chase, but I gave you Ace and Chase. Ace and Chase will live on forever in this game in my world. Liam's tie. Your name was a little longer, but it didn't fit. So hopefully this is okay, but you got the purple. Then we have slice cakes. Ah, dude, I could go for a slice of cake right now myself. Next is shadow, which kind of is fit. It's fitting. You know, the dark blue with the darker blue uh, outlines. I like that. And last but not least, little rat bag the yellow. I think you're the only yellow here, which is crazy. Thank you guys so much for those who wanted them. There you go. I hope that kind of fits what you wanted and you'll forever live out in my in my game, especially with the lockers. If you want a locker, let me know. If you want a Seamoth, let me know. And we're just going to continue from here on out, baby. We're just going to continue from here on out. Having spent all the Uranite crystals I had the other day, it was time to do a little more digging. So back inside the kelp zone, it was with two willing hands, my hands. I wanted more because now for some strange reason, I had this yearning thought to build a base back inside the void. It definitely wasn't because of all you people wanting me to build a base in the comments. Couldn't be. No way. That said, that was my plan and one I'd soon regret. It started with the crystals in my inventory, working my way to another reactor, and then a scanner room with all that jazz. Problem was picking the right spot. If I chose poorly, I'd be a dead man walking. Now I just needed to stop making myself dizzy and find a place to actually set up shop. And then all we do is bingo, bongo, boom. -o. Superpower! Power restored. All primary systems online. We are right at the cliff of the void. The thing about Shadow Leviathans is that they had a tendency to form in packs, you know? There we go. It is coming fast. This might break it right here. Wait, wait, wait. My turn then. 
I could hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Guys, I don't like this. I don't like this. I don't like this. I like it. 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 I'm fighting this one. We'll fight this one. There's two of them. There's two, there's a bigger one. I don't know what depth I'm 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 oh. No, you don't. No, you don't. No, you don't. Get out of here. Nope. Stop it. Go away. Go away. Oh my god. Oh my god. Dude, I don't like this. I don't like this. No. Stop it. Stop it right now. If I just stay here, like you'll both get caught, right? It's that, it's that simple, right? Oh god. Oh god. Oh. 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 Um, 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 nope. There's three of them. There's three of them. There's three. Ah, it's okay. If I stay in my bubble, we're fine, right? Just stay in the bubble. Just <laughs> stay in the bubble. Stay in the bubble. Stay in the bubble. I just gotta stay in the bubble. The mother flipping bubble. The mother flipping bubble. The mother flipping bubble. I stay in the mother flipping bubble. That one's even bigger. Holy crap. Holy crap. Holy crap. Holy crap. Oh my god. Help me, baby. Oh, my God. Okay, one, two, three. Is there a fourth? Come on, bring it on. <sighs> bring it on. No oh, crap, I missed. I might be dead here. Maybe. We'll see. I don't know. I think I could win. I could totally win. I could totally win. I'll win this. Um. Okay, let's see if this works. I don't want to fight anymore. I don't want to fight anymore. Uh, this is a bite. Oh, bye, 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 birdie. I gotta see if they're coming for me, though. I think they're still coming for me. Look away, guys. Look away. Oh, damn. Oh, damn. Oh, damn. Oh, damn. Oh, it looks like they're still coming for me. I don't like this. I don't like this. I don't like this. I don't like this. I take it back. I take it back. I take it back. I never want to go back to that base ever again. I never want to go back to that base ever again. I don't want to fight these things. I don't want to fight these things. Like, I legitimately wish I could. I really, really do, but I can't. I can't. Like, I'm actually... Looks like they're going back. All right, I'm going back too, guys. Now, on to the next of Sweet Peas. It was time for a little R&R &R downtime, let's call it. Get this beautiful baby going. The cuttlefish is the cutest thing ever in this phase. When it's in egg form, it looks so adorable. Like, look at it. It's like a little puppy with the puppy dog eyes because they're so big. It's like a little pug puppy type of deal going. It's adorable. Look at it. It's so cute. <laughs> I really love it. It's adorable, man. While traveling back to the Deep Grand Reef, it was me, the Warpers, and some revenge time. Ooh. Did you just... Really? You know what I'm gonna do? Here we go. Oh, wait, wait. I gotta get the other thing out. Crap. Where's my knife? Knife, knife. Oh, you teleport even though you're... Okay. Not today. Try to throw a teleporty thing at me. Uh-uh. Ain't gonna work, buddy boy. It turns out this would be so much harder than I thought because they ghosted me every two hits. Since that was the case, it was time to check out the Lost River and all its secrets. The first of many being some crab squids I could kill. Aha! I can. This one doesn't teleport. Take that. <laughs> Got him. The stasis rifle plus knife on these guys stood no chance. Seeing the cuttlefish so happy the next day, that's when I knew I had to find more of its family one day soon. Oh, you hatched! Hold on, hold on, hold on. Look at it, look at it, look at it, cuttlefish. See, this is where it gets a little, like, you know, it's not ugly, but it's just like, oh. For the time being, I was back inside the Lost River, setting up a little scanner room. You guess the theme of this video? Scanner rooms and sea moths, baby. <laughs> So now I was looking for nickel ore. Surprisingly enough, this place would have everything I needed. I totally expected myself to need to drill more veins for this stuff, but no. Not only was I lucky for all the nickel I had, I also managed to make myself an orange tablet for this cave here too. Come on. What's inside of it? <laughs> Never mind. Ion cubes, baby. Ion frigging cubes. Okay. What is that? Oh my God, cuttlefish! There's another one here? Okay. Oh, all right. I got another cut of fish here. Oh my God. Heading back towards the surface. This was my favorite part because my family was about to get two times bigger. All right. Second cuttlefish coming up. Here you go. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 
<laughs> Hello. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> Goodbye. The coolest thing I found out days before was this nice little entrance back inside the blood kelp biome. This cave entrance had me traveling to the Lost River in half the time, compared to traveling through the Deep Grand Reef, getting lost, and trying to fend off warpers. My plan now, looking for the way into another Precursor's base. All right, let's give this a go. I'm sure I can find something. Right? Right? Yeah, there's the something. I just need to find a way inside. Don't you dare. Go away, punk. I'm going to leave it inside because I don't trust these guys out here. They'll probably destroy it. <gasps> not not nothing. I found the Ion Cube again. Ooh, ooh, what is this? Insert. That's purple, failed. right? Dude, it looks pink to me sometimes. I don't know. Probably shouldn't have done that, but oh well. I got data downloads. Did nothing. UVDA nice. System. He tore it apart and everything to do research. That is awful. Oh my god. You good? Oh my god. I'm so sorry. Between all the remains I found and the experiments done to warpers, I had to go deeper into the rabbit hole. <gasps> this is lava place too? Oh, I might come here and build a base then. I've never been this way before, so this should be interesting. Yeah, this is the lava zone. Holy crap, this was another entrance inside. I've never found this, not once. Kyanite right there. I didn't even have to go to the Tree of Life area. And I, oh. ba, 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 ba. Okay, so we're building a base here first. Holy crap. <laughs> oh my god. So that's legit a way in. I'm taking this way in. Today I felt ready. New alien tablets and all. Something I did learn the hard way was how the sea moth stood no chance versus the shadow leviathan. Having everything I needed, the habitat tool practically saved my life. So we do have a place here. We got oxygen. We're good. Now to deal with the bigger issue at hand. Well, that's the castle there too. Holy crap. Hello. Um. Hi. Don't shoot your fireballs. Don't, 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 don't. I think I got it. I think I got it. I think I got it. Hold on. I need to do one more in the face. Oh my god. <laughs> that was one way to go. <sighs> okay, okay, okay. Oh, it saved it. We we went back right here. Cool. I was about to say, you know what, guys? We're done. Nope, we're not done. Hold on. It's still there, too. I just gotta kill this. I just gotta kill it. If we can kill it, we win, you know? Game over. Not really game over, but we win. Got it. Okay, I'm gonna do one more when I'm closer here. Bah, there we go. Not only did this take me a good 30 to 40 minutes, but after all that damage, this is what I had to deal with. It's trying to run away. It's trying to run away. You're not running away from me, buddy. Oh, crap. You're phasing. You're phasing. Uh, where are you? Where'd you go? Where are you going? Since I wasn't planning on staying long, I needed to make the rest of my adventure that much smoother. It started with new fins for my feetsies. Wonderful. Okay. Yeah, we're swapping out fins. Swim charge, no more super fast speed. Next, I made my way towards the Aurora, looking to pick up any food past Ray may have left for me. Okay, this is gonna hurt. Yep, there it is. All right, yep, that was the fire. I didn't want the fire on me. I didn't want the fire. Fire! We're good, we're good, we're good, we're good. Okay, water. Oh, a lot of water. Any snackaroonies for me? One snackaroonie, two snackaroonie, three snackaroonie. As I was leaving the big crashed ship, this Reaper Leviathan was waiting for me. I want to go over here. Not because of you. You're just get out of here. Just get out of here. Yep. Pick me up so I can just zippity zap you. Get out of here. Since I was in the neighborhood too, it was time to make my family even bigger. Apparently the next cuttlefish egg was under the mushroom biome. Whatever that meant. I found the creature egg. I am going to die. It's worth it. Uh, if I can keep it, I'm dead, dead. I give up. I This place is way too confusing. My brain hurts. The map is way too hard to read. Happy to just be outside the maze of horrors. It was time to look for the time capsule I needed. Time capsule, baby. Whoop. Tap the view. Oh god, that's terrifying. Hi there, friend. I hope that you're reading this. You never suffered the same terror as I did in this moment. <laughs> this horrible creature of the deep had stalked me for two days and nights. 
forcing me to seek refuge in a strange forest of mushroom coral. I probably should have been worried here, or at the very least anxious, but because I had the sonar in electrical field, I felt safer than ever before. Thinking that this would be the sinkhole I was looking for, that's not exactly what I found. Da -da 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 -da. My friend. Hold on, hold on. I want to go inside. And then I'll read it. I just wanted to say that if you found this capsule, I escaped. But sadly, I couldn't take my friend with me. It always made me smile. Thanks to it, I didn't feel lonely. Please take care of it and give it as much, just as much love as I did. I also added a little model and poster of the Aurora, which is going to be Altera's next ship. Looking to scratch my itch the next day, these would do just fine. As I headed back towards my base, my stomach was rumbling. I had the best idea for a perfect snack. More like perfect snacks, plural, but hey. It worked. Now for the next cuttlefish location. Inside the second mushroom forest and one that was hidden away inside a random cave. Find... Oh yeah, there's something in there. All right. What the fudge is right there? Look at it. <laughs> hey, that was so quick. Whoa. Hello, little cutie. Cutie patootie. Look at him. Look at him. Look at it. Look at it. It's so cute. As I continued on the next day, I definitely didn't get lost. Nope, I'm not lost and I know exactly where I'm going. Okay, maybe I was a little lost and panicking while inside the dunes. Just in case. Yep, we're good. Wait, wait, hold on. That guy's... Gotta make sure, guys. Gotta make sure. Um, cuttlefish. I have all five of them. <laughs> you guys wanted me to get all five. I got all five. I did everything. I've done officially everything in this game that I can do personally. Now we just need to get the heck out of Dodge. Today, my family would grow three times bigger and more beautiful than ever before. One, two, and three. We're gonna, we're gonna have more family. I have all the cuttlefish. Thinking about what Subnautica had to offer, this had to be it. Attempting to find everything I missed last time and looking for the one thing I really just wanted. Is this like pod seven right here? Holy crap, this might be life pod seven. Hold on, I'm gonna zip it zap. Life pod seven? Life pod seven! No friggin' way! Hold on. I gotta check this out. All right, we have toy car. Beautiful. Toy car. Cylindra. <gasps> All right, you guys ready for this? Here we go. Unusual doll. Oh no, what's so unusual about it? For the next day, I needed more pieces of quartz. Planning to fabricate and build a little something something and wake up the best way possible. All right, let me know if you guys see something as I'm waking up to a new day here. It's like, you know... When you wake up to a new day, it's like, oh, look at this. It's so pretty. Nice new day. Oh, my. Look at this. Look at this fella. <laughs> I did it, guys. Oh, yeah. oh man. You notice anything now? How about now? <laughs> <laughs> uh, <laughs> so great oh hello <laughs> oh it's so good hello what the fudge who just what i can't even see what's happening i'm recording Do, what did someone follow excuse me guys if you didn't know i have uh twitch twitch.tv slash ray of pandas go follow it right now because someone else followed 200 people follow we will hit the newest record of them all 200 people <laughs> <laughs> now, this next part was definitely backwards thinking because I figured my sea moth would be able to kill these big leviathans inside the lava zone, forgetting that I didn't actually have the depth for the sea moth themselves. I even attempted to look for the other leviathan near the castle, maybe try to aggro it and bring it in, but there was just nothing. So here's what we have to do. Oh, I actually hit that one. Really? That was an accident too and I hit it? Okay, cool. I need more damage. It seems like the knife is the strongest thing. Oh, whoa, never mind, never mind, never mind. I take that back. Oh my God. <laughs> I take it back, guys. I friggin' take it back. So while making space inside my inventory, I was free to place my little outpost further into the lava biome. I wanted to place closer to the Empress Leviathan, and this would be just the spot. Something I did take for granted throughout all my playthroughs was the map the Sea Glide offered. Finding the entrance to this new place, I was about to find all of the shiny things. It's so much easier without the prawn suit, if I'm being honest, just because it's not like I have more control over everything. I remember the prawn suit, that part was just so tough. <laughs> so tough. Here we go, guys. 
Oh, we made it. We've made it. <laughs> I'd have got the scanner. Purple tablet. Oh, purple tablet for the blue one. Okay, so once we get the blue one, we can make one of each. I need to make at least one or two of each if I can. I own cube it is. I'm taking the risk. We're going to risk it. I know I shouldn't because we do don't we don't have as many. Like I don't have as many cubes, but portal time. <laughs> Whoop. Here we go. Yes. Oh, we could also self scan. I forgot about that. This next part definitely caught me off guard. Oh, my hands. Oh, the 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 <laughs> the Karar disease. Oh God, oh my God. All I had to do now was swim back to my base and get some tablets made. While getting everything ready for my next trip, this part always made me smile. This one tablet gave me a way in to get the most important thing needed. Oh, 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 hi. Hello, hello. Next, I was grabbing the recipes also needed for a build that came later on. Ion battery. Now for the hard part and trying to live while dodging and weaving. <laughs> oh my goodness. That is crazy. We didn't even have to really build that much. Blue tablet. Yes, here we go. Here we go. So we do need one more. Okay. Because this is the way in. Then there's another one we need. So if we're going to build this, we need two kyanite crystals. I realized that I did actually miss some and I can grab some by hand. I honestly thought I'd have to cheat for this part, but quickly remembered that the castle up top did have smaller pieces to pick up. I'm just going to stay behind it. You know, I'm just going to stay behind it. I'm going to stay behind it and we'll be fine. He can't slap me with the tails, right? <laughs> stay behind it. It's trying to turn around too. Oh my god. Okay, cool. While reaching topside, I figured two birds, one stone. Looking to grab all the pieces needed for the enzyme Mamio needed. Oh, right there. Look at that. I already found one. We need one of these. I stock. Thank you. The next part of this recipe was back inside the mushroom biome. I decided to look for the sinkhole once more. Almost getting lost again. Yay! See or sea crown. That's what we needed. Sea crown. Welcome All right. Now I can go back. The next area I needed to find was the bulb zone and filled with all the creepy crawlers, even shadows lurking above me. As I traveled back to the lava biome, I was in desperate need for those kyanite crystals. This is more than enough. This is so much more than enough. I love it. I love it. Sure, I did have to give up a piece of enzyme recipe, so that left me going back home. For now, Sweet Pea and me parked our butts, built the fabricator, and got this one thing right. Uh, oh, yes, 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 yes. Oh, this took forever. You have no idea. I mean, you might have an idea if you've done it before, but like, ugh, it's, it's a real challenge. Like, I mean, so many things I could not do, but now I can. Splish. <laughs> Splish, splash. I was taking a bath. Where's my mommy at? Mommy. <laughs> oh, mommy. <laughs> mommy. Oh. Are you here to play? Others came here once. They built these walls. They played alone. They bored me. Now they're gone. And instead, we have you. You have me. We are curious uh -huh. whether you uh -huh. swim with the current or fight against it as I they did. Swim with it. I swim with the current. Are you guys ready? We are about to build the Enzyme 42. Finally. Holy smokes, man. This was it. The final part and giving Mamio what she wanted. I hate to do this to you, but your babies need to get free and then I need to also be free of this virus. <sighs> yeah, 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 yeah. Here we go. Your babies are free. My young are swimming for the shallows. I thank you. Their freedom is my end. What will it be like, I wonder, to go to sleep and never wake up? Perhaps next we meet, I will be an ocean current, carrying seas to a new land, or a creature so small it sees the gaps between the grains of sand. Farewell, friend. Hmm. Is it weird to say that I'm curious to see what's on the other side? I don't know. Maybe it's just me. Sorry. Okay. Enough of that. <laughs> oh, no.
And there's the jellies. Oh, yeah, the jellies. Look at my thick fingers. Ta da! We did it, guys. We friggin' did it. Contracted, concentrated enzyme 42. Today was going to be a great morning, not only because of Mark and Jack, but because I had the big launch platform ready. That's insane! <laughs> Oh, it's gonna hit me. Let's get out of the way. Hold on. Wait a minute. Let's do. Okay, right, that's good. Ooh, this might be perfect. Uh, away we go. I perfectly missed him. Oh my god, my depth perception is off. Are you kidding me? <laughs> it really is too. Next was gathering the materials needed for the gantry. All right. Yeah, dude. Yeah. That's what we call a diving board. Okay, we dive off into the unknown. Soon after, it was the big old Neptune launchers. So there's this. I think the last one is the cockpit. And then that's it. This is where things got a little tricky because not only did I need to find extra sulfur, but I needed more kyanite crystals. This is it. This is what I've been waiting for. Oh, yes, 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 yes. We got it all, guys. We got it all. All right. So I can move the mobile vehicle bay. I'll move that once I'm building the power. So we have the power supply and then we'll have the cockpit on top. And that is that. Having everything ready of all things I'd run into was not having enough space for this darn thing to craft. But I can't wait for it. I cannot wait. I don't want to wait. <laughs> Here you go. Oh, hello. Ah, that's was the last part. Today was all about the high fives. High five, high five. <laughs> Say farewell. There you go, man. There you go. I love you too, buddy. You guys are the best. You guys are the best. The best. Look at them. They're so creepy with the tentacles. And now it was time to name this wonderful masterpiece. Oh, <gasps> ooh, that's cool. Like a nice red. And that wait, is that red or is that purple? It looks red there, but I'll make it more red. What the heck? Look at this. We got yo-yo up there. Yellow, red, blue. I love it. I love it. I love it. I was gonna make it a Christmas tree, but then I was like, that's too soon. You know, people get upset. That's <laughs> that's too soon. Gotta turn on the auxiliary power. Number one. Next one is auxiliary communications array. Next. Communications systems array active. This Karen sounds so cute. Oh my god. If a number? Maybe? I don't know. I want a number. Hydraulic systems. The end? Cannot launch rocket while quarantine. Enforcement platform is still active. Of all things to forget, this had me backtracking to the island and finally placing the purple tablet in its slot. Never mind, I guess it does work. Holy crap, we shut it down. We did it, guys. I, I think. Oh, we totally did it. Oh, jeez. Okay. <laughs> I keep forgetting about that stuff, man. The moaning and groaning. It doesn't want it to be turned off, but it is. Likes to be turned on all the time. Not this time. When it sees me, turned off immediately. And now, the race towards the giant rocket and to say adios to this planet one last time. Yeah, let's go, baby. Let's go. Let's get out of here. Ready to launch on your command, Captain. Launch in 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. one. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, 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 every time, man. I don't care what people say. I still get excited over this stuff, man. Doom, doom. Space. Yes. Caution. Approaching orbital debris. Here's the shield protector.
We made it, guys. We made it. Field clear. Performing gravity turn maneuver. And there's below zero down there. Ha <laughs> ha! That's the next one. Confirm destination coordinates. You know what would be so cool, though, is if this next game that's coming out, when they finally are finished with the story and everything, does it continue from a little bit of this? Because technically, upstairs that you saw there, that was below zero. We are going to a completely different place. Does it continue off of this, or is there, like, you know... I don't know. Oh, man, I don't know. I'm so excited for that. Oh, here we go, guys. Here we go. What is a wave without the ocean? A beginning without an end. They are different, but they go together. Now you go among the stars, and I fall among the sand. We are different, but we go together. <laughs> 